Sustainability investing. You've probably heard of it, but do you have all the facts about it? It's important to separate the facts from fiction. First, does it cost performance? No, in fact, the opposite is true. The use of environmental, social and governance principles by companies and investors can enhance performance. The economic evidence is clear. Analysis of hundreds of academic studies and other reports show that in 80% of the studies, sustainability practices have a positive influence on investment performance. It enables them to evaluate possible future risks, create more efficient supply chains, and better conserve resources. In other words, it has a direct financial outcome on company results, which feed through into investment returns. It's not only about being green. For sure, looking after the environment is important. But sustainability is about far more than simply avoiding pollution or combating climate change. Sustainability is also about the fundamentals, like good education, quality food production, and sensible supply chains. Just relevant to a handful of idealists? It is simply smart investing. Renewable energy, for example, is the biggest business opportunity of our times. Replacing fossil fuels with sources such as solar power is leading to trillions of dollars worth of investment. Is sustainability all about excluding sin stocks, such as tobacco or gambling, and divesting thermal coal producers? Avoid the bad guys like the polluters? That's only half the story. By integrating ESG into their analysis, investors can select those companies that anticipate and manage future opportunities and risks. By focusing on quality, innovation and productivity, investors are better prepared for the future. An asset manager would therefore prefer to select companies with a positive environmental and social impact. In this selection process, active ownership, using an investor's position to influence companies, can also play a role. Engagement is used to persuade companies to become more sustainable, and those who are responsive or agree to change poor practices may be selected for portfolios. Millennials have the highest levels of interest in sustainability, but its origins date back to the 18th century, when Quakers refused to invest in the slave trade. In the modern era, it began in earnest when environmental pressure groups first came to prominence in the 1960s. Decades later, more than 35 trillion US dollars of investments were made sustainably in 2020, or about one and a half times the GDP of the United States. And this trend is now so well established, it is sure to continue. Some say that SI has no clear impact on society. That's not true either. On an international level, governments and companies, including investors and pension funds, are working hard to meet the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals. These 17 goals range from ensuring the availability of clean water and sanitation for everyone, along with achieving food security and gender equality within 15 years. And society itself is changing. Remember when smoking was common and electric cars were rare? Now it's the other way around. People are more involved with demanding change, and companies cannot get away with some of their behaviours of the past. To get back to the truth about sustainability investing, our society is changing at a rapid speed, and the need to put all companies onto a more sustainable path is not a hype nor a trend. It is the future, and it is here to stay. Rubico recognised the potential of sustainability investing at an early stage in the 1990s. We were among the first asset managers to take an integrated approach to sustainability investing, and we now have over 27 years of experience in this field. We firmly believe that it leads to better informed investment decisions for our clients. If you'd like to find out what sustainability can do for your investments, find out more at rubico.com forward slash SI.